Okay, it's been a year. <laughs> Is that your serious voice? Yes. <laughs> it's, it's been a year. It's been <laughs> so we're off to the vet because one year ago, we rescued a dog. This one. <laughs> This is my baby. This is my Simba. This is my Simba. Who's driving this car? Not me, Simba. No. And you get the thinking. This is right. Well, it's one of these movies where you just look into the side forever. <laughs> <laughs> We're on our way to the match. I think I told him that already. Huh? I think I told him that already. I asked you. You said no. I just opened the video. I See, lack of communication here. Do you see this? No, lack of listening this? skill. No, you did not. I said I opened the video. Yes, but you didn't say the rest. What was the rest? We found a ball in her bag. And of course, I got in scary mode immediately last night. And we started researching the web, which you shouldn't do because it's horrible. They tell you all the horrible things. They, you know, they basically killed Nala last night. <laughs> Uh, if bigger than now, uh, this is a little problem. Okay. But normally, no problem. Okay. You remember when you were like that? You were mommy's girl back then. This is what happens, and you always worry. Yeah, and no, now we have to monitor. And you know me. I'm going to say it's bigger. <laughs> we'll be back. Nala. Nala, up up. Vamos. Up 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 up. Good girl. And the shampoo. <laughs> These kids. Close it. That was a good road trip for nothing. It's possible still the injection, even the um, reaction to the injection she's got almost a week and a half ago. Oh, because she got the kennel cough and the rabies vaccine. Yeah. I but, forgot about the rabies vaccine. Yeah, well, usually those reactions happen on the same day, right? I would say usually two to three days later. Yeah. If anything, it'll be then, but... It's been over a week now. Yeah, so I wouldn't think it'll last this long, but hopefully that's all it is. They checked it out. We just got to monitor it for now, and that's it. But these are the things that happens when you have a dog. You see all this stuff, and whenever your kid gets a boo-boo anywhere, you think it's the end of the world, and you take them to the vet or the hospital yeah. for anything. And I know that we were talking on the other video about you know, this is expenses that they create and yeah, you have yeah. to be ready for it. And this is the thing, finding Nala one year ago changed our lives so much. And that also includes finances because you have vet visits, you got food, you got accessories, you got Airbnbs if you're doing that and, and oh. It's just so much. It's a lot, it's a lot. Yes, I love my eggs. And yes, I'm fighting to pick it up. <laughs> So we made it back in time for breakfast, or in my case, fishy. fishy. This lifestyle, we were pretty much certain that we couldn't have a dog because of this lifestyle. And we've questioned, was it a mistake because of the way we live? Everything now we do is in a van. We travel in a van. We live in that van. We eat, we're sleep, and van. poop in that van. Especially the last one. Especially the last one, yeah. Pishi, I tell you. <laughs> there were moments when we were in Serbia, living in Belgrade, that we questioned, should we keep an apartment? Should we keep a household and not get a van? Would van life with two big animals be the right thing for us to do? I think one of the most difficult things from this transition of how we travel, how we live, has been the sacrifices that we've had to make. We lost a lot of money on Airbnbs when we found Nala because we had a whole road trip planned. We lost a lot of opportunities with work because when Nala was younger, we couldn't leave her home by herself and we were too scared to leave her home and trying to do any video or photography gigs was, was difficult. You know, you realize the things that you have to put aside or things that you have to just lose. And I don't even remember what life was like before Nala. I, I can't remember, like days of flying on planes and traveling that way, just being able to pick up and go and here's my passport and that's it. But today that's not something we can do. We've lost the ability to necessarily fly because we don't want to put them on a plane. Mm -mm. And that means no more, no more lounges. No more lounges. No more lounges. No more flight anxieties. No more free wine. <laughs> Your free wine. Free food. 
Free food, free food in the, the lounges, lounge. yeah. I love how your perspective of dogs have changed <laughs> so much. She was not a dog fan, but your perspective of dogs have have evolved to a whole new level. I always like dogs, but I, you know, if you make me pick between a dog and a cat, I'm always gonna pick a cat, even up until now. Nala is my baby and she's my priority over every other cat in the world. But I love cats, like I'm a cat person. But I do have to admit that now I'm more sensitive to dogs. Like I, like I wanna protect them more, I wanna be their mother, I wanna like carry them with me and feed them and, and fight for the rights. So that's a bold faced <laughs> lie because <laughs> she walks both Nala and Simba. And when you walk Simba, you let Simba do his thing, he walks around, they walk together. But I cannot tell you how many times she's come back from a walk with Nala back in Belgrade and was like, oh, these freaking people leaving potatoes out in the street, there's broken glass everywhere, there's garbage everywhere. What is wrong with people? Don't okay. they know I'm walking my dog out here? But what's, the dogs wrong, walk out what's here. wrong with people? Like, why do you have to litter so much? Like, seriously. Like, okay, forget about dogs. A baby's walking down the street, falls and get a freaking bottle glass in whatever. That is me. that okay? I did that all my life. Exactly, exactly. It was a part how of, much part of better, growing up. No, how much better would it be if people don't litter so you don't have to face that thing, that thing as a baby or as a dog or as a cat? And, you know, cats are more resilient. So, yes, that's why I worry about my Nala because she doesn't know. She sees food and she acts like she has never eaten in her life, so she will go grab it. And just like her, any other animal. And potatoes are toxic for um, dogs, garlic, onions, all these things are bad for dogs so I understand that people is trying to put food on the floor for those straight animals but you're actually killing them. We lie to ourselves so much trying our best not to get attached to her because we knew we wanted to find her home and we that we couldn't have a dog. You're not adorable. We don't love you. And you're not our dog. No, no. <laughs> I don't know your name. We haven't named her. I know I told you this before, but you know, just in case. Be strong. These aren't, these aren't tears of sadness, they're tears of joy. Joy knowing that we'll find her a good home. Yes. Yeah. Life with pets is life with her. <laughs> life with fur. Oh my gosh. <laughs> so. Besides all the sacrifices and all the possible bad things that we could be living with them or since we got them, the motivation has changed. Like, I wake up with extra strength every single day because everything we do, we do it for them. To have a better life, to have more toys, to have more food, like everything goes towards them. So was it a mistake to sacrifice the lifestyle that we used to live? Or to open ourselves to danger and risk or to pick up and rescue these two and start van life. No. Sorry, <laughs> Sorry. It's a whole table back there. Why would you have your knuckle out to hit me? It wasn't my knuckle, it was, it was my, my tummy. Oh, and it has a nail on it. Yeah, well, yeah, uh, a nail on it. <laughs> no, it needs to be cut. You need to be cut. So Hit me happy. directly in the middle okay, of my I'm bone. Okay, I'm sorry. There is a bone. Yeah, exactly. I'm sorry. <laughs> Are you trying to kill me? You crazy You tried to paralyze me, so I returned to paralyze your Allah. <laughs> you laughing about this? Don't look back. <laughs> Be serious. Just be serious. One year ago, <laughs> so one year ago, 